Hello, everybody, and welcome back! Yay! We're done with BlizzCon! BlizzCon was so amazing! I had such a good time! Uh, you can't even begin to understand how absolutely, absolutely fucking amazing BlizzCon was. It was spectacular. It was everything I was hoping it was gonna be. Um, but yeah, here I am, again, post BlizzCon, Inquisitor Aura. Welcome back to my stream, those of you who are watching me. Uh, those of you who are new on Twitter, hi! Hi! This is what the Treasure Goblin looked like. Uh, my Treasure Goblin cosplay went over amazingly, amazingly well. I threw chocolate coins at people. It was fantabulous. I loved it. Um, and as you know, there's no more Warlords of Draenor beta because that shit drops in two days. Two days! And I can't wait. So all of you go ahead and go get your free daily done and preps and shit that you need to get done. Um, I am actually going to start, you know, my second favorite game of Blizzards, and that's Diablo 3. And I'm sorry, Demon Hunter, because come on. How fucking badass is that? How badass does this chick look? This, look, this chick looks like she would kick your ass and you would enjoy every second of it. Yeah. So that is Arsai, of course. I named all of my archer type people's Arsai. You find the good names, you stick with them. Oh, I've got my, uh, before I go any further, I've got my Dalaran Academy t-shirt on. See? Dalaran Academy, this is my podcast, you guys. Um, this is the t-shirt, this is one of the two t-shirts that we have on sale, um, on our store at, uh, d20crit.com. You can get this in purple. You can also get it in black, plus a variety of other shirts. You can get shirts for just D20 Crit, you can get shirts for Demoralizing Shout, you can get shirts for a bit of Geek and Nerdery, whatever you like, go get them. Um, we will be doing another episode this week. We're going to do, be doing a lot of post-bit BlizzCon Squeam and a lot of pre-Warlords of Draenor information is going to be coming out. That's where we're going to be discussing leveling guides and things of that nature. Um, Garrison builds potentially, but mostly probably just going to be leveling guides. Um, so let's just get to it. I mean, fuck it. Let's take a look. I'm going to get the, the prelims out of the way and we'll let you guys see what I'm working with here. I do not, and I'm not completely legendary out yet. You'll see that here in a second. I'm going to show you the talents I'm using and the uh, abilities that I've decided that I are gonna, I'm going to work with. Okay, so my as you know, hatred, this one flaw. Okay, my hatred building ability is Bola's. I'm going with straight up fire damage. I, I like it. It blows things up. It makes things die. It's great for farming. So it's what I'm using. So I got Bola's with imminent doom. Okay. Uh, we got cluster arrow loaded for bear. Now, I have two defensive-ish abilities, and so this helps me a lot with uh, my mobility and helps a lot with my survivability. Um, for the most part, I am going with an overall fire-ish type build, although I may switch my rain of vengeance over to something else. Alright, so, Vault. I got the Rattling Roll, which is stunning off back enemies you vault through. Always nice. Uh, I've got Smokescreen Healing Vapors. This allows me to disappear and heal. A little bit, so it helps get me back up in case, you know, Cormac, like the dumbass that he is, dies, which he does quite frequently. I've got my sentry totem down here. Now, right now, I have it set as a Spitfire turret, although, if I do have problems with survivability, because I may switch it up to Torment 2, I am I'm really just kind of getting back into playing Diablo again. I haven't actually picked it up in a couple of months. Uh, I've been concentrating on playing WoW and getting myself prepared for Warlords of Draenor, and then of course BlizzCon came around, and then all gaming pretty much went out the window last week. So I'm going to start off in Torment 1, and then I'm probably going to work my way back up into Torment 2, and then Torment 3. Um, so just just bear with me here. You'll see what I do, you see what I'm, I'm working with. Uh, Sentry, Spitfire Turret, once again, fire damage. Um, but if it becomes a problem with for me, I will go with Guardian Turret. Uh, which is what I've used in the past, and it is actually fantastic. And then Reign of Vengeance, I'm actually going to switch this back to Shade. I know that's Lightning and that Stampede is Fire Damage. 
Um, actually, no, we'll just keep it at this. Uh, Shadow Beast, it's super long, get around, and basically drop bombs. Okay. My passive skills. Steady aim. I, I'm actually probably gonna switch that out now that I'm, because I'm used to actually doing this with my husband's Crusader. And he has the, the, the Mega Thorns hit me build, in which, uh, he hits them and they hit him. But when they hit him, they do take damage and they basically just throw themselves on him. With his 75% block and all of this crazy ass healing that he gets, and and they, they just die. So that's nice. Um, but that's what I have right now. I'm actually probably gonna switch that out to perfectionist already. Um, uh, that movement speed. Behind. Yeah, I was using that for a while out when I was still slowing things. Ooh, you know what? That might be good. Ballistics, damage of rockets, ambush. Somewhere else. You know what? We're gonna go with sharpshooter for now. Just because, which is, like I said, this this is flexible. I, I tend to, to move these around a lot, so you'll get, you said, I have Perfectionist. Of course, reduces the discipline cost, which is always good, because discipline is fucking hard as hell to get back. Uh, you just gotta wait it, just gotta wait it out, which sucks. Archery. Uh, bonus based on your weapon type. I do, I am going high with the critical hit chance and critical hit damage, which is why I have, um... Hand crossbows. I prefer the hand crossbows over the regular cro the crossbows and the bows. Bottom line, that's just all there is to it, and you'll see why here in a second. Um, and then awareness. Whenever I receive fatal damage, I vanish for two seconds and regenerate fifty percent of my of my maximum life. Once again, this all ultimately comes down to survivability for me. All right, we're gonna take a look at my gear. Um, I have everything cleared out. Yes, I have a fuckload of blood shards that I really need to, to get around to spending. I am not uh, I am not legendary at all. I am still looking for a legendary neck. Um, it, it's coming. I'm sure it is. But uh, here is here is the cream of the crop. This is my baby. This is my honey. This is the thing that I love the most out of everything that I own right now. That I have on this character. This. Right here. Holy shit. Did I just roll off of this? Okay. I got this hand crossbow. Okay. It says level requirement reduced by 22. Yes. 22. It was doing that much damage 22 levels ago, and that's when I picked this crossbow up. So I was literally clearing through shit like it was going out of style. It was ridiculous. How hard I was hitting things. And an 8% chance on hit to summon a spike trap, a cow traps, or a sentry. I get all three of them. I get it quite frequently, actually, because chance on hit to crossbows, it does apply the chance on hit to the second crossbow as well. And I just hit so many fucking times. It's just like, oh, here's cow traps. Oh, and here's a turret over here. And oh, here. Hey, look, there's another turret over there. And oh, hey, look, there's a fucking spike trap over there. It's great. I love it. It's perfect. Um, and the, out, the set I'm going for is I am going for the, I've got the four piece, uh, in Natalia's site. Look, which, uh, the cooldown of Rain of Vengeance reduced by two seconds for every enemy I kill. I like having my Rain of Vengeance. I like using it a lot. So I do use it a lot. And I have the, this is only being made possible right now, obviously, if you know Diablo, then you know what I'm talking about, the Ring of Royal Grandeur. Which I have on, uh, which reduces the the set the number of pieces required for your set bonuses by one. So I achieved the four set, and I only have three pieces of this. Uh, the other set I'm going with not actually for that. I'm looking for with my Marauder set, okay. And I'm going for um, I'm going for the six set here, which once again will be the five set because I'll have the ring. So we'll see how much I actually manage to pick up. Um, I've got 
some legendaries and some some set bonus things in, in, in places just because they happen to be better than what I was wearing before. Like the Demon's Restraint and Captain Crimson's Thrust and the Waiters. It could have generated 2000 like per second, reduces cooldowns, you know, more survivability stuff. But ultimately, these things are going to be, you know, going away um, for the Marauders. I'm going to get the Marauders. I'm going for the, the pants, the boots. I'm actually pointing at my screen right now. So just go with, go with crazy. Go with craziness. The, the pants, the boots. Um, the shoulder and the, uh, the casement and carapace. I don't remember what all of these are. I, I have it figured out. I have it written down somewhere that I could actually feasibly do this. I think I need to trade out like this helmet for uh, Natalia's reflection, which is a ring. Okay, and then I can have the Marauder helmet. But you, you, you see what I'm getting at here. We're good. Um, I'm not gonna spend any of my blood shards. I'm just gonna come on over here and we're just gonna open up a fucking wreck and we're just gonna get this shit going. Oh, I actually have to actually have to have the keystones on me now. Greetings, Nephilim. I can Yeah, blah blah blah. I have plenty of keystones, they're all in my bags. I mean, come on. I'll just take a hundred of these out. Fuck it. Whatever. And we're gonna do this. Rest. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, place a keystone. I can't just click on it now, that's just so weird. I don't understand. That's okay, we're going in. Tormented Trail, let's do this. Tier 1, Torment 1, Demon Hunter. Let's fucking rock some shit. I got Cormac with me because, frankly, it's just easier. I mean, he does kind of tank, sort of-ish. Maybe a little bit-ish, but not really-ish at the same time, does that make sense? Um, and he occasionally does come in handy. Occasionally. But not often. See, and that's what I like to see right now. Sorry about there for a little bit of lagging. Get a little laggy laggy. Bombard the shit out of everything. Just set it all on fucking fire. Okay, so, um, let's find guys. There, I have a bunch of pictures of both myself and my husband. Um, he was the StarCraft 2 Marauder. That looks fantastic if I do say so myself. Nope. You guys need to fuck yourselves. Not Good time. See? See, that thing just drops shit just absolutely everywhere, and I love it. It's so great. See, I got one way down here. I don't even remember getting it down here. <laughs> All sorts of yellows for my disenchanting pleasure. Cluster arrows are fucking amazing. I'm actually gonna go back up here. I have uh I have this this OCD tendency in Diablo that I have to explore in, in the map. Doesn't make a difference if I need to go that way or not. I will. I need to. It's it's, it's like it's part of who I am. I don't understand. Not enough hatred. Build up that hatred again. Hey, there it is. Keep moving, keep mobile. Watch Cormac die repeatedly because he's dumbass. Get up. 
motherfucker. Seriously. I'd bring someone else. I mean, maybe I should go back and, like, actually, like, equip Irena. I mean, I actually, I haven't, like, done anything with anybody else in this game. I almost always take Cormac because it's the lower levels. And, like, freaking... God, motherfucking waller bitches. I'll fucking die. Come get me. This is where the fun starts, right here. <laughs> I clicked on that for reasons I can't even begin to comprehend at this point. <laughs> What's up, bitches? See, those walls fuck you up almost as much as they do me, so... I got this shit! I ain't gotta worry about you! I ain't gotta worry about you none! Not even a little bit. Uh-uh! Stay away from me from that shit. Think I got time for this? I got time for you? Uh-uh! <laughs> What's up, motherfucker? <laughs> I love that shit. I so do. It's just like... This is my favorite class in the game. I love the Crusader, don't get me wrong, because she is such a snarky brat. It's refreshing. Dude, see, nothing, no problem. No problem. I just need to get a little bit more gear. I want to get a new necklace. I want to try and get most of my ra Marauder set. Um, but as soon as I get a, a legendary necklace, I'm going to be switching up to uh, Torment 2. You ain't got shit on me, son. Uh, uh, uh. Mm. 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 See, is that OCD part of me again? Gotta explore everything. All, all of that. All parts. All parts of that. Especially since there's always shinies around here to be picked up. And I got I gotta like hit like every like every nook and cranny, every box, every dead body is gonna get tossed. Because uh legendaries can literally show up anywhere. Anywhere in this game, so we're gonna go uh, down this way, I think. And I use my Rain of Vengeance all the freaking time. Doesn't make a difference. I don't really care. Okay, there's a yellow over there. Orbiter fucker. Fuck you, Orbiter bitch. See? Oh, man. It is so nice. And I will just abuse the shit out of this fucking dodge too, by the way. Just abuse the hell out of it. <laughs> it's like the best thing in the world. I'm sorry, did you did you did you want to hit me with something? Uh -uh, I don't know where you think you're going, motherfucker. I should get some music playing in the background one of these days. Love it. It's delicious. It's so amazing. Get a drink. Remember, kicking beans out. Ooh, that was fucking piece of shit. Nobody asked you. And kicking demon ass always makes sure that you. 
properly hydrate, and yes, you should be concerned that I'm not drinking coffee right now. So we got a little extra, extra something, something going on up here. Don't worry about there. I'll be yeah, out randomly just vault in different fucking directions for just reasons. having like three turrets down at once. I mean, it's phenomenal. It's like, I don't even do half of them. Like, they're not even mine. It's my Hell Ripper. My Hell Ripper does it. I have like the whole thing. Like, my whole concept for my Demon Hunter is built up around having this crossbow, which drops extra turrets for me. I mean, how is that not absolutely phenomenal? I mean, it drops shit that I don't even have. The, I'm not even, I don't, I can't even use. Like, cow traps and spike traps. I don't use that shit. But it drops them, and I don't have to worry about it, then I don't have to worry about it. It's all good. Let's fuck that one, dude. Oh man, don't you know I'm a train killer. Fucking Cormac, what I'm gonna say, what the fuck are you doing, dude? <laughs> Ooh, my fucking tools, which man. Uh-uh. This wall or shit's gonna keep me in here? It might keep me in here, but that means you stuck with me. I don't necessarily know if that's some place you want to be right now. <laughs> stuck with me. I'm gonna just go like this, and I'm gonna like this. I'm gonna make it so much fun. I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna drop my turrets. I'm gonna go back. Can I drop my Rain of Vengeance? Or my creatures bomb the shit out of things, that's cool too. And I drop my turrets and I go this way. And I stop. And I go back. Oh, fuck you. Ah, you bitch. That was a good catch. Good catch there. I go like this. Get out of the exploding thing. I stun you. And I dodge through you. Which stuns you, which is amazing. I'm gonna get out of the exploding. And I pick up my money. Like, beat demon ass, question mark, profit. Yes. And it's, look, I'm already halfway through the freaking. I mean, admittedly, it doesn't really take all that long. Oh, you motherfucking fire chain, bitch. Oh, you think those illusions scare me? Those illusions ain't doing shit all to me, boy. You better watch who you're stepping on. I ain't got shit on me. First, I probably should not run right into the orbiters. Maybe a bad idea. Maybe not a good idea. Maybe just do one of these numbers. Get my money in the process. Drop a turret. Mm -hmm. Come around here. Do one of these. Nothing. It's good. It's gravy. Love it. This is the game. It's like you just want to come in here and kill shit. Just come in here and kill shit. That's what you wanted. That's what they want you to do. They want you to destroy everything. Like that. No, that didn't really give me anything worth worrying about. Oh, I still got shitload back there to explore. Hmm. If we hit the exit here, I will go back. Like I said, it's like they put the walls up and it's like, and you're stuck with me. 
Is that, are you sure that's really what you want? Most, most bad guys are not really sure that's what they want. See, you might get out, and you're stuck. Cormac, of course, is useless as always, and you cannot. Don't teleport me, bitch! I will move my damn self. I don't need your help. See? Easy. Get my money. Pretend like you don't even exist. Pretend like you, you ain't shit. You ain't shit. Nothing. Nothing! Good stuff. You said to start fighting me as Morlocks. God fucking almighty. That's Morlocks. I really hate those guys. I mean, it's bad. My their my hatred for the Morley literally knows no bounds. I don't think I'm gonna try to grab them. I don't think I'm gonna kill them all that fast. So. Hmm. Poor as Cormac uses ass. I told you, I just, I abuse the shit out of my own I just, I just use it all the time for every goddamn thing I possibly can. Dumb says it can't hit back. We all the angels broke by illusions. The weird shadow babies. The weird Melisandre shadow babies. Um, so I'm actually looking for some new material to read. Now, if you'll pardon me here a second. While I grab my current reading material, I'm actually rereading the uh, line of Senate. I don't know if you guys can see this. Um, by Jennifer Fallon. Uh, it's a very good, fantastic book series, uh, low fantasy. Definitely a very, uh, very good read. Oh, got my, got my, my, my Diablo 3 hoodie too. I got this, uh, some of my BlizzCon loot. Demon hunting hoodie. What's going on here? It's nice and warm. It's all long and stuff in the back. It's like, it comes down to my thighs. It's great. Honestly, it's like the back of my chair. And, um, so if you guys have any, um, this is only the first book, and I'm only that far into it. So if you guys have any other suggestions for books that I should be reading, um, that you think I might not have read, I do read a lot, so I'll keep that in mind. I do have a Kindle, too, so Kindle, Kindle format books are not off the table for me. So, um, if you have suggestions... Uh, for books I should be reading, or that you suggest that I should read. Um, I am all ears. Please feel free to leave comments, uh, talk to me in chat if you happen to see me streaming, um, anything of that nature, and let me know what, what kind of books uh, are good or what you like. Um, I am very much fiction fantasy reader. I will read sci-fi. Uh, I loved uh, Starship Troopers. Uh, yes, the book and the movie. I like the movie too, but it was nothing like the book. It's kind of funny. Um, uh, and Things Like a Forever War by uh, Joe Haldeman. Very, very good science fiction there. Um, but uh, low fantasy, high fantasy, George R. R. Martin style, I'm talking Dragonlance, uh, Belgarian, Malorian, things of that nature, uh, anything. I, I literally, if it grabs me in the first sentence, or for, I would give it even so much the first page or so, then um, it's probably going to be good. Um, I've tried, I've tried reading Malice and Book and Fall. Okay, I have it. I have all ten books. Um, and I do want to get through it. I do. 
Believe me when I say that I do. Ooh, kind of a one. But believe me uh, when I say that it has not been easy in the least bit to do so. Um, the pylons are amazing. Fucking goddamn arcane bullshit. Kill everything in sight while I still have my conduit pylon thing going on here. Yes. Fucking amazing. I don't think there's anything left here. And it's off. Okay. Um, so yeah. Uh, I, 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 I have it. I have all ten books of Malazan Book of Fallen. I, I understand it's one of those book series that you kind of have to, you know, get into. But I, I, and I read the first book, and the first book was great. You know, once, you know, got, once you got past the couple chapters, you just, it's kind of like oh, walking through molasses there just a little bit. Um... But once I got through, like, the first, I don't want to say, I would say, I would say the half of the book. I keep going to go in the wrong direction on that map. Um, the first half of the book. Um, I'm not going to go all the way back. I'm just going to keep going this way. Uh, is, is when it picked up, and I started the end of the second book, and it was just, it started off slow again. It's like, it's just not, it's not air it doesn't get me the, the same way that, uh, George R. R. Martin's books got me, and Belgariad got me when I was, like, 14. Um, and, you know, the Dragonlance books, which made me, I can't read now, because it's like, holy shit, why did I like this? They were fantastic books, don't get me wrong, when I read them as a kid, and they were great. That's, it's kind of like that gateway jar, some gateway books right there. Um, alright. Novelist, Pat. Um, but at the same time, it's just... Mm, you know, you know, it's just kind of <sighs> having a hard time. So I, my husband's actually using my Kindle right now. Uh, he's reading Treasure Island, which is a classic. Uh, so I'm trying to read things, paperback books that I have um, available to me, so that I don't, you know, take away from from his reading too, too much, because he, he's reading that for work purposes, and I kind of just want to let him have it uh, available to him, because I will take it to uh, to school with me, and he will never see it again. <laughs> I mean, admittedly, it is uh, my Kindle. It was a birthday present? Christmas present? I don't remember. It was a gift. Uh, it's a, it's not a paperweight. It's a second gen Kindle, and I still have it, yes, and it's still phenomenal, and it's still kind of amazing, and I'm not going to replace it until it breaks. I'm not going to get one of those backlit numbers because those things make my eyes hurt. I'm not going to get the Kindle Fire because it's the same reason. It makes my eyes hurt. I mean, it's great as a tablet, I'm sure, but, you know, besides that, um... Not really my style, if that makes sense. I love I love the feel of paperback books. Um, I'm just as good uh, reading on Kindle. Doesn't bother me in in the least bit. I'm not a book purist. Um, I love books. I love having books, and I will always buy just regular books. Um, but I'm not going to, you know, just not get the technology because it doesn't smell like a book and it doesn't feel like a book and some people think that means that it's not a book when it is a book. It is a book. Okay? It's gonna make a difference. Are you still getting the same enjoyment out of it? Are you still reading it? Are you still putting yourself there in that world and seeing it, you know, through your own eyes? And fuck you, you goddamn skeletal archer bitches. Um, it doesn't make a difference the medium that the book is being delivered to you on. It just matters that you're reading it. And that you're enjoying it. Um, because since you're not reading it and you're not enjoying it, then what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> I mean, I, I am an avid reader. I am an English major. Um, not... Uh, the reason I am an English major is um, mostly because I, I am an avid reader. Um, I want to be an editor. 
Um, I'm convinced I can do this without an English major, but I understand English major helps me. Um, <laughs> what the fuck are you shooting at? Oh, there's a goddamn- Oh, there's a fuzzy- He's a rainbow goblin! Oh my god, I want him so bad! No, treasure goblin, come back! I need you! Come back, you little bitch! You little piece of shit, Wendy Shire bitch! Come here! I kicked that treasure goblin's ass. Rainbow goblin, no! Stop it! You come back here! Get over here, Luke! Come back here! I carried you around BlizzCon all day, motherfucker. You better show me some damn respect. Yeah! <laughs> Why does little pink bag see? Little pink bag, isn't he cute? <laughs> carried him. And his evil little brother around with me all day at in my in my loot costume. <laughs> He's so soft. Uh, and actually, I'm friends uh, on Twitter with the, the, the person in charge of marketing for Blizzard, Cutie Pie. So if you're watching this, Cutie Pie. He's so precious and I love him. I'm gonna back down here so you can go back to guarding my Skyrim book. <laughs> um, Fucker, that little cheeky, fuck, cheeky little fucker. Just little cheeky little fucker running away from me. <laughs> oh no. Um. Okay. We're gonna go back to town. I, I, I have to. I'm sorry. I can't just leave shit laying on the ground. Not gonna happen. Never gonna happen. So don't, don't ask me to, to do it, cause fix all my shit. Salvage all my yellows, all my blues, all my grays. Dumped all this crap in the bank. Do, 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 do. Want that? Want my angel wings? Back to the hole. Oh, by the way, um, uh, if you guys uh, are looking around on the internet and you happen to see pictures of my treasure goblin cosplay and go to Photoshop, feel free to photoshop you know, goblin portals um also uh put the links on my facebook page in visitor r cosplay and nerdery uh or on twitter or on instagram all of those are going to be at inquisitor r i promise you i will find them um and i would appreciate it there are also going to be some videos out um cosplay boom was at blizzcon on friday and saturday um, and I was only dressed up all day on Friday, but I know, I'm almost certain that, um, they got some sh footage of me, even if I didn't interview with you, which is fine. Um, I'm not gonna be like, oh, you didn't interview me, blah, 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 blah. No, uh, it's not, I, I don't even care if I necessarily made it on there. I'm, I'm pretty sure that I did, that I know a lot of people were, uh, videotaping me, um, being chased around trees, um, pillars inside the convention center, inside the lobby, convention center lobby. Um, I was chased. I was smacked in the head, not hard. Um, um, as I was giving out my uh, gold foil chocolate points, and I successfully gave out all of those, and it was amazing. I loved it. I had a blast. Fuck all this goddamn. Arcane bullshit. Fuck you. Fuck you, Miss and Damping. Ass monkey. This is like the worst goddamn combination of shit for me right here. I hate Arcane Enchanted. It is the biggest load of bullshit I think ever. I'm trying to get down all this extraneous crap. Well, I try to take out Dread Chomp Fang because names. <laughs> oh, there's the Rift Guardian. Fuck you, bitch. God damn it. This shit's gonna suck. Fuck you, bitch. This shit's gonna suck. Oh, don't wanna definitely do not wanna stand in that. Um, <laughs> I'm just saying, standing in that, probably not such a brilliant idea. Get over here. 
You got some shit to say to me? You get over here, you say that shit to my face, bitch. I know, I'm such a shit talker. I can't help it, I'm just in such a good mood right now, and this is kind of how I like to express myself, which is weird. I'm told it's weird. Um, but it's normal for me. So, um, I apologize if I'm offending any of you with my incessant need to... Oh, yes, legendary ring. <laughs> My first legendary this this turn. It's actually that's actually not bad. All right, Ryan, get over here. You and me, we better have a problem. I am not about to die here. So you can take this job and shove it. I am not working here no more. I need my turret too. What's up, spike trap? Oh, look at mine. Ha! Ah. Ha ha! Not my spike traps. <laughs> Not mine. Um, I almost kind of wanted to do a in my loot bag. If you uh, if you look on the pictures, and I have a bunch of pictures up on my on my Facebook and shit right now. Um, I had a bunch of coins, gold coins, and you know, fake plastic swords and uh, fake plastic jewels sticking out of my bag. I almost kind of wish I had thought of this. Um, putting in like a super bright, like a ridiculously like a spotlight bright um, LED in my bag of, of the, the bright orange light that would just like shoot out, like you can see it like everywhere all the time, no matter what's going on. Um, which would have been awesome, but I never thought about it. Get my legendary, yes. Get all the rest of my shit, yes. Um, and that is the last of that. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and head back. I need to go because back. reasons. That was a nice quick. Nice quick rift. A uh, nice quick rift run. We're gonna go ahead and see what we got here. Justice Lantern, oh, you have to be kidding me. Green Lantern ring, Justice Lantern. It's crap. So it's gonna get disenchanted. Um, <laughs> have you spoken to all doop, 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 fix some shit. Doop, 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 break it all down. Yes, I don't have any grays. I'm fix the did, did, did. Uh, salvage. That, yes, I'm sure. Yes, I know it's crazy, but I did it anyways. Put all the crap in my bags. Shoot that off for no apparent reason. And we're gonna come down here, we're actually gonna spend some of these shards. Games are fine, her ass. Well done. Well done, champion. champion. Thank you. Let's rift. Talk to Kadala. And now I am looking for some different pants and different boots. Three amulet. What a steal. See, there's like a hundred though. It's like, ah. So, so they increased the price of all of these shits, huh? Yeah, they did. Do you can get more out of it if I do this, though. See you soon. Meh. Worth a shot. I have gotten legendaries out of all of that, so. I got, um, like some mage fists or something like that. I don't remember off the top of my head, but we're going. We're going to go ahead and go back in, uh, since I'm almost level, uh, 75, or Paragon level 75, I should say. Duke, duke, duke. Go. Oh, open it. In we go. Off to destroy many, many Unleash more things. Your power, the mental conundrum. Fun. No, no, no. Oh, no, no, you don't get to do that. You get to blow up. You get to blow up. You get to die.
on a frozen person molten. That what frozen? Did they change what frozen pulse looks like? That's what frozen pulse looks like now. That's pretty fucking cool. Oh, no need to go all exploding in on me. Just fuck a bunch of that noise. Do, 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 do. Cormac is literally over here just punching some random ass dude to death. Oh. It's refreshing to know that the help is still just as dumb as I remember it. Oh. <laughs> Get some! And get that, that tendency of mine. I need to clear out the whole fucking thing. He just fucking does too, by the way. They're annoying. Oh shit. Um, especially in the ruins of Corvus. It's like, oh hey, look, I'm gonna go around a wall. I'm gonna get through a wall. I'm gonna come out here and it's gonna be stupid and you're gonna hate me forever. I'm gonna do. I hate it forever. Up or down? Up or down? I'm gonna go different. I'm gonna go down this time. Oh, it's cute. You think that's cute that you can teleport around like that? Well, you know what? Go screw yourself. Problem getting right up in y'all shit. Predator satchel. Oh, quiver. It only works if you have a bow or a like a regular crossbow, but I don't. I'm using two hand crossbows, cause it's what badasses do. Okay, maybe not necessarily what badasses do. It's just what I do, and it's just the way I prefer to play. Why do? Toss the bodies. Well, see, and that's why having sentry totem, sentry, sentry totems, I sentry totem, um, sentry turrets is nice, because they are like your early warning defense. Like, oh, hey, look, there's still shit over there. I'm shooting at it. See, it's right here. Nice. We are gonna do finish off this rift, and then, um, I'm actually gonna try to start streaming earlier. I did this dream earlier today because I was just kind of like, I was relaxing, I was left in my death night, I was just having a chill day today, and I was like, no, I'm good right now, um, and I'll just do that later, after, you know, I take a bath, and after I eat bacon, I had BLTs for lunch, or for dinner tonight, and it was, it was great, fuck, I did arcane enchanted bullshit, I can handle like anything else. This arcane enchanted shit just fucks me up, man. I hate it, especially when they put some shit like this. Like, bitch, fucking please, come get me. <laughs> nope. I just nope the way, nope my way on out of there. Drop another turret, uh, another totem. I'm, I'm so used to playing a shaman and calling them totems, even though I'm maining a priest and warlords of Draenor. Um, which I actually need to organize with bars and shit at some point in time. Good god almighty, seriously with all the fucking arcane enchanter right now? I can deal with the plague, I can deal with the molten, I can deal with the wallers, but you make every goddamn thing arcane enchanted, that's when we start having problems. Arcane enchanted is the bane of my motherfucking existence, I hate it so much. Get off me. Get all that. Get all that money. All them things. All that stuff. It's amazing. 
I'm just gonna keep on going this way because I have a feeling eventually we run into a dead end over here. So I'm like, y'all, I still see you. <laughs> you can't hide from me. Diablo 3, the game guaranteed to force my wrist into acting up. <laughs> You ghost. Hmm. Nettle in power. Nephilim needs more legendaries. Less money, more legendaries. Kick the loose stones. Get that experience. Hey, dead end. It's got fun. You just gotta find the dead end. And kill spiders. Kill spiders. So I kind of like what these cavernous things right here is they all eventually will just come together. Eventually all the little paths that seem to be leading to nowhere will all eventually lead to the same place. Fuck you and your wall, bitch. Fuck you and your wall, bitch. A wall and raise your bar a bombardment bombardment that goes over your wall. And since we know there's a charge chest over here, naturally, this is the direction we're gonna go. We're just gonna. <laughs> I'm just gonna literally just gonna let my turret take care of that. Life is good. Life is very good. Okay, man, it's good here. Deeper down into the rabbit hole. Mm. Let's figure out what that is here. Power, let's go. Let's abuse this as much as we possibly can. Ooh, that card is rich. Oh, that stone had a lot of money underneath it. Oh, shit. That guy was broke. It's cool, though. It's cool. 
Man, seriously, you give me a power pylon and you don't give me anything to use it on? I feel jipped. Definitely feel like I, there should have been dead people around for me to fight. All these go connect together up there. And then we'll roll this way. Go to the dead things. See the dead mother dead now. Alarm is dead. And Cormac said again. No, I should just switch him out, right? I should, but I, I honestly don't don't know that anyone's any better. And you guys, you guys are all gonna die. Oops, nope, yeah, 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 now that shit. Oops. <laughs> so much stuff. Love it. So much crap that I'm like just gonna go back and just disenchant the hell out of it anyways. So it's like I mean I could jack the difficulty up a little bit, like if this is more of a warm-up for me right here. Get a couple of riffs in a torment one, nothing big. Nothing I can't handle just gets me used to playing the game again after being gone for uh, you know, a week because of BlizzCon and just general other nerdiness. Yeah, yeah, it's good. Screw your walls. Go this way. Oh, you mother bitch! I hate arcane so much, so very much. I can't count this Julius cameo if I'm gonna be doing this arcane bullshit very long. Later. I got a thing of Kool Aid. What's it called? Yeah. What's up going on there? Legion the Dan. Yeah, well. I got his minions. And we go. We continue on. Should be getting close to the end of this one here soon. This is a big ass case this time. Yes, Paragon level 75. Excellent. Let's spend that shit here in a second. I mean, you know, at this stage, it really doesn't make a difference what I spend this shit on because I don't have a lot. I only have 75 points. Um, <laughs> life regen. Yeah. Just because uh, it's like everything else in that tier is just kind of like. Armor? Who cares if I can regenerate the hell out of everything else? Hello, watchers. I see you. I see you lurking. Welcome to my stream. Is there any place that I missed? Where did I miss? 
I gotta go all the way back there. <sighs> all right. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Shoot an arrow for no apparent reason. You don't need to make it obvious. What are you talking about? Don't need that. We should be hitting in here sometime soon. We're 61% from that. That's good. We fought a lot. We fought in a lot of shitting. That wasn't all the like, racist against German there. He was in German, but. I thought it was fine. I'm joking. I'm sorry if my voice still sounds really, really raspy. I'm noticing that now. Right now. Right now. Just right now. I'm noticing that my voice is sounding a little kind of hoarse. Um. We did kind of scream at the top of my lungs for like two hours uh, during the Metallica concert at this time, and uh, my voice really has recovered yet. I haven't completely recovered from this time yet, I'm not going to lie, I'm still so very, very tired. Um, I stayed at a friend's house, um, so I didn't have to get a hotel, which is very nice. Um, my handler's sister lives up in Fullerton, I'm not telling you all, no, so now it pass. Um, and that's where I was. Um, but my husband had to sleep on the floor, and my husband had to sleep on the floor, and I slept on the couch. Um, but I was in... I don't know what I was doing, because it's not like my costume was heavy. The mask was awkward a little bit, um, but I could wear it comfortably. I mean, I wore it just fine all day. Uh, the, the loot bag was light, um, but it's like I woke up like a couple of times in the evening, um, and it's just like my shoulders were... I can't like screaming, just terrible, bad pain in my shoulders and my elbows and my wrists. So, ooh, plan, Mark of the Magi. Bosses How to create a legendary staff. That'll be great one of these days when I have a wizard to actually use the legendary staff, but I don't. Uh, I said I wanted legendaries, but that's not exactly what I was talking about. Why don't we just go ahead, take this back, and put your portal back, and give plans, get rid of the stuff. Um, get rid of the shit. Shit. You know that. Repair all the things, salvage all the other things. Um, stow those same things back in here because. Reasons actually I'm not using them not really using them right now. Back into the rift. And into the next level. Oh yay, serious. Fun. Do, do, do. We just done all the things, all the things, done and things, all the things, all the things, it's done the things, it's done them all, all the things. Teleporter for the mortar. Yeah, I did too. Horus Cormac is still down. What am I gonna do with him? What am? What am I supposed to do with you, Cormac? You're making it so hard for me to keep you around. You're making the decision to get rid of you easy. Not like it wouldn't take me just a little bit of gold to replace your ass.
I'll take the short distance teleport. I don't really care about that. I need to do something with all these gems. Oh, I hate those guys. Oh, I'm gonna let you hit me, but I'm not. I'm gonna be a bitch. Gruel to the grind. Big ass mamma jamma over there. Those stupid idiot seraphim things. And this is the Reaper of Souls level. Up this way first. Ew, bloody corpses. Ew, bloody corpses. Gross. We're at 88%, so it will not be that much longer before dude, dude man shows up, dude man boss guy shows up with his oh fuck. <laughs> with his oh fuck me sideways. gonna be. I saw that Mount Lord and those Mount Lords mess oh geez. a mess up a mess of this demon hunter chick up big time like huge No, Cormac's your own fault for saying it. Please tell me I'm not the only one who witnessed that. <laughs> Cormac literally standing there like a dumbass. <laughs> Fuck you and your walls. I got time for that. I got time for these walls. Okay, oh, right on top of the crates. Now it is a battle lord. Ow. <laughs> I'm like, nope, 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 nope. <laughs> Dodge. Nope, stop trying to hit me. Nope. <laughs> you were not allowed to do that. Nope. <laughs> uh uh. <laughs> nope. <laughs> really? He's like, nope. Oh, got me that time. Damn. I was wondering how long I was going to be able to keep pulling that off. Nope. Uh uh. <laughs> oh, what is this? Yes! Fuck you, Brandy.
Zoom! Love it. Ah, crap. I was gonna say, did I, did I run out of room? It doesn't look like it. Awesome! I'm gonna get that Nephilim ripped up. Reasons, because, and stuff, and things. All the stuff, pick it all up. And, uh, that is it. I'm gonna go ahead and back to town. Chilling out. Treasure chest over there. Back in! Can't leave without all the stuff. Leaving without all the stuff is bad. Okay, now we go back. Now we can go back. I got some new things. Then we can get our reward. Impressive. We can collect our reward, and that is it for today. Uh, thank you for watching. Um, this was a little easy, so next time I am going to be kicking it off to Torment 2, possibly Torment 3. Um, so, stand by to stand by on that. Remember, go check out my Facebook and my Twitter. Uh, go look at my pictures of my loot. Um, look out for the next episode of Dollar Night Academy. Come out here probably on Friday. And uh, we will see you again in a couple more days. Alright, bye.